Hi, I'm Caitlin Olson from It's Always Sunny in Philadelphia and Finding Dory. And we're here in my hometown of Portland, Oregon, shooting fashion for Good Housekeeping Magazine. We are here in Portland, Oregon, which is where I grew up. Uh, what I miss about Oregon is the seasons. It's so beautiful and it's very green. It's turned into a really amazing city since I left. Today's shoot was really fun. We were all over the city, which was exciting, and I was happy to see people, and they were happy to see me, which was cool, and we had some good food and drank some good beers, and my dad showed up to one of the spots, so that was pretty awesome. My hairdresser was on her phone checking her Tinder account the whole time today, but I think we still, I think my hair still pr looks pretty good. You good, Abby? Any more? Any more matches? Okay. My shopping strategies are to figure out what you do most in your day and then spend your money on those kinds of clothes. So even if I'm spending a big part of my day taking my kids to preschool and picking them up, I'm going to spend uh, money on loungewear and workout clothes that I feel good in. Four things every woman should have in her closet. A great pair of nude heels, great pair of black heels that are timeless, simple, and one really good bag. Like, you can go vintage if you want to, and a great blazer that you can throw on with everything. In Finding Dory, I play a whale shark named Destiny who can't swim very well. I am most like this whale shark because I'm extremely clumsy. Whale sharks are gentle and they don't have teeth. And I do have teeth, so that doesn't answer the question. My kids are very excited that I'm gonna be in Finding Dory. We watched the preview no less than 55 times. Uh, yes, I've trained both my kids. When I say, who's the funniest woman in the world, they say, it's you, mommy. So that's working for now. The best part about working from, four. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> The best part about working with my husband is that I get to see him every day because we have really busy schedules and so we only see each other in the morning and like late at night so when we're working together we get to see each other all day for a couple months so it's great. Something that people might be surprised to know about me is that I grew up in a very tiny little town outside of Portland and we had a farm. We didn't have a ton of animals but we did have a goose, just one goose and we got her when she was a baby and she would ride around in my bathroom pocket you know, in the mornings and stuff. And she loved to snuggle, and I loved her. Her name was Maddie. Rest in peace, Maddie. Hope you enjoyed the future. No, that was bad. Don't do that one. Abort. Let's start that one out. Shh. I got this, you guys. Sometimes lies come out. You just go with it. All you gotta do is just keep lying your way through it.